Hi everyone, my name's Scott and welcome back to my channel. I hope you've been having a great week and a great month so far. Before we get into the 19th video of my book, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. The 19th chapter of Take It From a Teenager is called Living Like There's No Tomorrow. This chapter is all about embracing the opportunities life gives you and living your best life. Ironically, this chapter begins at a funeral. As you walk between rows of chairs, people slowly come up and say a few words. It's only now that you realise this is your funeral. Don't worry, I promise the whole chapter isn't this grim. Halloween is next week after all. What are these people saying about you? You might imagine kind words or perhaps some unkind words. Either way, I use this imagined scenario to ask my readers, what is it you want people to say at your funeral? Regret can be one of the biggest issues in life. Sometimes for the things we did, but most of the time for all the things we didn't do. So this chapter focuses on how you live life. Now, when people think about this, they might think of the word destiny, that magical, fantastical, fireworks, amazing thing they're meant to achieve in life. But it's not going to be obvious or easy to find. Embracing your purpose in life is all about making your mark in the universe, no matter how big or small that mark may be. The word universe is made up of two parts, uni and verse. Uni means one and verse means song. In this way, we need to achieve our purpose in life to contribute to the grand song of the universe. A key part in this is asking the right questions. It doesn't matter if you find the right answer if you're asking the wrong question. My point here is that you need to constantly question yourself, no matter how scary those potential answers may be. On the note of matter, know that your life matters. Your life impacts other people whether you know it or not. Another part of this chapter is goal setting. Here I share three steps to effective goal setting, beginning with a basic three question structure, where have you been, where are you now, and where do you want to go? The world gives us many opportunities in our day to not only change our lives, but the lives of the people around us. We need to be more open to taking these leaps of faith, no matter how big or small. But a word of caution, pursuing your purpose in life won't be easy. No matter what anyone tells you, even what I tell you, everyone's life journey is different. Take charge of your life. Plan out how you're going to reach your goals. And if your plans change, learn to change with them. I wrote this chapter because the future can be pretty scary. There are billions upon billions of possibilities of what life might be like in a year from now. Especially with how the world is right now, it's hard to maintain hope and hold onto the possibility of purpose. I like to think that 15 year old Scott is telling me, and you watching this, that everything will be all right, that things get better, that you got this. I wrote this chapter to not only help my readers with their goal setting, but to encourage them to pursue their passions. It's easy for us to become stagnant, to settle for fine, for okay but you are made for more. You have the ability to move mountains, to cross oceans, to save the world, to be the reason someone smiles today, to change the fate of humanity forever. Okay, that may be a tad dramatic, but just remember that you got this. No matter what your destiny is or what your purpose is in life, know that you have what it takes to achieve it. And with that, thank you very much for watching this video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this one. I post every Saturday, so make sure to hit that notification bell so you never miss a new video. A link to my book can be found in the description box below. If you live in Australia and want to get yourself a signed copy, head to my website at www.scottbradbrook.com and fill out a contact form for a special discounted price. And until the next video, live a life worth writing about, whether it's in books or in the stars.